our trip to Africa, part one, Cape Town. South Africa, here we come. So we're here at the airport. We actually left from Pittsburgh and flew to New York. Just looking at this just really tripped me out. And no, all of this is not my luggage. We have finally arrived in Cape Town and Port Elizabeth. This was one of the first places that we stayed in Cape Town. And as soon as we opened the door outside of our room, this is what we saw. Absolutely breathtaking mountains, landscape. It was just absolutely gorgeous to just walk outside and this be the first thing that you see every morning. One of our first stops in Cape Town was the Akaya Trust Center. This was actually an after school program and as you'll see in the pictures coming up, the kids were amazing and they performed it for us into the night. Another day and we have made our way to Port Elizabeth and we are actually on our way to do a little shopping and try to go to the top of Table Top Mountain as well as just kind of see some of the sights around. gateway because we were actually on our way to Robin Island. This was one of the boats um, that were at the dock, but that's not the one we took. We took the Susan Kruger, which is this boat here. And as soon as we got to the island, this is what we saw. Beautiful, all over again. <laughs> Interestingly enough, this is actually a former prisoner who is going to take us on a tour around the island. And if you were a prisoner, this is how you enter the island. And if you remember, I showed you the Susan Kruger. Well, we got off the boat, but this is what they did when they got off the boat. And this is a picture of former prisoners. Now, as dreary as this island was, there were all of these random beautiful animals. You see here we have penguins, there were antelope, bunnies, this amazing lighthouse. 
this is actually solitary confinement. You enter through the front laying down. This was the inside of a prisoner's camp. And on the floor here is the actual cot that the men slept on. And here on the wall was the daily serving of food that each man would receive. This literally was the last picture that I took before we left Robin Island. Part of our trip consisted of attending an HIV AIDS awareness conference. And so part of that took place on Stellenbosch University's campus. So these are just random pictures of the campus. Very interesting thing about Cape Town is that they, their um, class system is a lot different from ours. They have white, colored, and African. Colored consisted of um, mixed race individuals. And so if you were not completely white or completely dark, you were mixed. We've left the campus now and we are on our way to a beautiful wine vineyard. Who knew Cape Town was famous for their wine? This vineyard is absolutely amazing. Center. The Zwani Center is a really interesting place. The Zwani Center was a kind of program where teenagers could come who were orphaned because of the HIV AIDS epidemic and they could participate in theatrical AIDS education. So instead of passing out pamphlets or telling someone to go to a website, the children would go into the communities, especially in the rural areas, and perform for them. And at the end, they would offer HIV AIDS testing as well as medications if those individuals tested positive. It was a really cool place to see. Here you see Hubby trying to act like he's paying attention, but don't believe that. One more thing about the Zwani Center is that it was housed in the center of a small shanty town and so many of the children who lost their parents would come and hang out at the center as well. We are still in Cape Town and this is one of the second places that we stay. There are a lot of bed and breakfasts there and so this is the outside of one of the, the second place that we stay and this is the back of it. Here's our room. Yes, there were two twin beds pushed together. Don't ask me why, but that was the room that we got, but it was beautiful, so who's gonna complain? If you open up that window, that's what you see, but if you go outside, another amazing view. <laughs> We stayed in Cape Town almost two weeks, and after that second week, we moved on to our second destination, which was Lusaka, Zambia. And yes, if you wondered, that is me singing Funga Alakia. <laughs> <laughs> 